guys, Omoyele Showare, a human rights activist and candidate of the African Action Congress, AAC, in the 2023 presidential election, says that his main attacks in Nigeria have continued because the government is unwilling to go after killer headers and those who support their heinous missions in the country. Shawari, in a post on Tuesday via his verified ex handle condemned the killing of scores of residents in several communities of Bokus and Barkin Lade local government areas of Plateau State on Christmas Day. He added that the body language of the Nigerian government over the years shows that the criminals enjoyed certain privileges. He identified it as a reason why they have continued to operate in the country. Shoare said, Plateau Christmas Massacre, it is not just one sad that Nigerians are constantly slaughtered by well-known herdsmen in Plateau and several places across Nigeria. What despicable is that successive, successive Nigerian rulers know these killers, killers' machines and their backers, that if and when they are not directly backed and sponsored by Nigerian elites in government, it is clear to all that those genocides enjoyed a special status. Hashtag revolution now. Sahara reporters had reported how the gunmen invaded Plateau communities, set several houses ablaze, looted farm produce, and destroyed properties during the attacks. This was confirmed by the Transition Implementation Committee chairman of Boko's local government area, Monday Kasa, to China Channel TV, revealing that the attack started on Saturday and lasted till Monday, Christmas Day. The local government chairman went on to say that the number of casualties was growing as more bodies were recovered by the team of security personnel, local vigilantes, and hunters who were still combing the bushes for missing people who were ambushed during the attacks. Reacting, the AAC in a post on X earlier described the incident as heart wanking, adding that, like his presidential, Muhammad Buhari, President Bola Tunubu was not ready to end insecurity. The killers on Christmas Day from the plateau to Castina is heart wrecking. This is one bad news. Too many for Nigerians, just like Muhammad Buhari, official bats, jacks the political will to fight insecurity. Okay, lacks the political will to fight insecurity. The way it should be fought. Enough is enough, the party wrote. Likewise, a chieftain of the party and activist Femi Adeyeye has demanded the immediate resumption of Tinubu to office to crop the menace. He said, we in the AAC demand that full action to crop this menace be taken immediately and that the sponsored commander-in-chief official bat resume duty. Tinubu should not be seen clicking uh, <laughs> glasses in Lagos. Why poor Nigerians are left for slaughter? We can't continue like this. Well, just like what he said, uh, they know those people who are doing this thing. They know them. But it's like they are too afraid to go after them. You will hear them say, and eh, they know those people, eh, but they cannot name them. They cannot shame them. But people are dying. Is it because it's not directly their family members? Do you know how it feels? When someone will come and call you that your brother or your sister have been slaughtered, no one deserves to die in such a way. These governments have to be proactive, you know, talking about insecurity. In fact, what is even functioning in Nigeria? Nothing. I am not surprised that these things are still happening. Those people who are surprised, I don't know why you are surprised. After all, the president said it, 
that is going to continue from where his prestige will stop. And he should know where he stop. You understand? It's just that the old things are now doubling. And that is what everybody should be expected. Make everybody get prepared for the worst. Not because, but that is the truth. When you look at the scenario of the whole thing, you understand that these people, they are not ready to walk. You understand? This is so very, very bad. The day people are supposed to be celebrating, they are mourning, they are crying for their loved ones. For how long are we going to keep on like this? Hence, men keep on attacking innocent Nigerians because no actions, no decisive actions have been taken against them. You know, say so when you do something, they can't take action against you. Get the kind of action when they go take against you. Fear not go let you do that. Thing. They are so jubilating. Now they get Nigeria. You get. The kind of power when these people get self is shocking. That they can they can just invade any community and they kill, you know, hundreds of people. Then they kill with that mercy. I've never seen this kind of people like this. But when one of them is attacked, the whole world will hear. Mileti Allah will not say anything. No. They have kept mute since. On Christmas Day, this news, you know, they're everywhere. They have not said anything. But may they attack one person or one of their cow, you will see how they go turn they go turn this country upside down. Is it a crime to be in Nigeria? Is it a crime? What crime have we committed? Because we are a Nigerian, what crime have we committed? The other day, the the CDS was telling Nigerian youth, eh, there is no need to this uh, Jakba syndrome of a thing. No need traveling out. No need going out. You people have to stand and fight for your country. Those country you people were, were running to, they stood to fight before they get to where they are. How you want to start? When we say those people who are supposed to, you know, do the needful, all of them are all corrupt. Are you telling me that they don't know what is going on? Where all these things are coming from? The truth remains that if Nigerian government want to stop this insecurity in Nigeria, it, it won't take them, it won't take them, you know, two days, all these things will end. But, you know, it cannot end because all of them, they all know what they are doing. God will judge them one after the other. So, guys, let's hear from you. Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Please, don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you have not. Thank you.